Hey everybody, we're back. Northern Land plays Fall Guys, and I mean, we got a win. We got a win in the final game. What can you say? If you're disappointed with that, you, you have unrealistic expectations, you know? Can I also tell you it's the glorious return of the metal straw? I don't know why I always look like I'm drinking through like a cup that somebody else is holding up to me in the hospital. I mentioned it in another series, but why why the metal straw? Iced coffee. It tastes better with ice cubes in it. it. Tastes colder at least. I'm not an ice and a drink guy normally, but you know, if you're taking cold brew concentrate and then you're adding water, you want to have some ice in that to keep it cold, I think. I'm realizing now this was not cold brew concentrate, this was cold brew that then I further diluted with water, but that's okay. It's already 2.43 in the afternoon. We're not trying to get pogged out of our gourd. Excuse me, tail boxer? That was a different tail boxer. Hit parade can be a little spicy. There you go. Just just keep it steady. Keep it look at that. Soft body physics have never stopped me. If you put ice in the drink, drinking without a straw from ice can be a little uh, obnoxious sometimes, you know, sometimes the ice all clumps together and then falls into your face. Um, honestly, we're, we're going for this, we're pushing in, we're pu and we're through, okay. So it's really like a roundabout process, then why not use a plastic straw? Well, you know, rather use a re reusable straw for the environment, it's not like a political thing, it's just like, you know, rather use one straw and a little bit of soap and hot water than, you know, 300 straws a year, they have to be manufactured in a... You know, polymer factory. Um, so that's how you end up with the metal straw iced coffee. That's how it's made. If you got a problem with that, you can direct it to my uh, complaint box. Also known as uh, the garbage can next to my desk. Alright. You can complain to me about real stuff. It's just that stuff where I'm like, that goes straight into the shredder. I print out the comments and then I shred them and I laugh. And I go, ha 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 ha. I don't. That would be environmentally wasteful. Okay. You know what? I'm. We've been doing so well, I'm ready for a team game. I'm ready for a tail tag or a hoarders or a... Um, oh, God. Come on. Don't get me jinxed. That's the only one. I beg you. Don't get me jinxed. Roll... Oh. Pennywise. I love rollout now. Rollout... It... it Honestly, I think they should give you a tutorial on how to throw people off on rollout. It drastically changes the game. It makes it ten times more fun. Okay, so it, this is where we want to be. We just want to find someone who's sleeping. No, we we're facing the wrong direction. Skirt. Whoop. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. We're still totally fine. Anybody coming over? Sir, sir, no, no, no. We, look, throwers, we've got to ally ourselves. I don't mind that. I don't mind that. Seven people have been eliminated already? What are you doing? Okay, this is where we want to be. What's the next step? Find someone asleep at the wheel. Energy drink. Ooh, send them. Okay, there's no reason to send there. That's fine. Eight people have been eliminated. It is, it's getting harder and harder to eliminate people on this game. I think like once you get eliminated once on rollout, you're like, I'm never letting that happen to me again. I can understand that. So I'm thinking like, we've got to start perfecting the idea of like a lateral elimination on rollout. You know, if we could get people while they're moving away from a gap or the gap rotates like where we could throw them, that's what we want to do then. 12 eliminated, huh? It's incredible. The, the can loves to be up at the front. That's not where I'd want to be. Gave him a little boost. Wasn't quite enough to finish the job, but that's okay. Look, you're not grabbing me. Maybe baseball. Maybe you can grab baseball. Just call me Heisenberg. Hank, when you introduce me... Can you introduce me as Heisenberg? I can't believe, like... Give Fall Guy a gun. That's my only request. It doesn't even have to shoot 
real bullets, if it just shot like bean bags, and you could hit somebody in the leg and then watch them careen off the edge, that's all I ask. I still don't, like... <laughs> Look, I'm not the best Fall Guys player in the world, but I think if you took me and then multiply it by the 30 people that were left in the game, how long would a rollout game last? It would la it indefinite, right? I don't understand why... Like, I, I, I just don't get how people die in the game if, they, if they're not pushed off, but then I'm like, even pushing people off is kind of hard. Anyway, I got the vision. Here's the thing, me and Pirate, we go a long way back. Ta ah, to Davy Jones' locker with you! Okay, well... You might say NL, that's not a pirate accent, that's just Scottish. There were a lot of Scottish pirates, I'll have you know. Davy Jones, of course. Formerly of the band The Monkees. Okay, we're getting a little bumped up here. But honestly, I like when the people do the bumping. Because it does knock other people off. There's like some... There's some fricky physics going on up here. That's all I'm going to say. Okay, stop. Stop. Yes, that's the way. We made it. Something didn't feel right about it. I'm not suggesting anyone's hacking. But the, the amount of bounce that was being generated on that tiptoe game did not feel right to me. I'm, that's why you don't do anti-cheat by feel. But it just seemed like a, people were getting pushed way more than... Like, that's, that's a slime climb level of push. I guess there was more people on that TikTok game than usual, but... Sorry, tiptoe. My mistake. What are we doing here, lads? Fall ball? 13-person fall mountain? Well, <laughs> uh, you know, it, here's what I'm going to say. We're seven minutes into the video. I always love making the final round. If you want to win, you're probably going to have to make the final round unless you manage to trick some people in a big way in, uh, in Perfect Match or something like that. So I, I got very few complaints. I'm, I'm a little annoyed with being grabbed there, but also that's life, you know. In the final round... You gotta accept that grabbing is something that's, uh, you know, there's the potential for that to happen. At least there's, like, a reason for it in the final round. That time, I, I'll just be honest with you, there was hubris. I didn't think I would get hit. Okay, pirate, I'm just gonna level with you. I know I said we go way back. You kinda screwed me. Oh my god. Oh! <laughs> The, there's no okay. You know what? That's the guy who grabbed me. I'm pogged about that. I'm pogged that the grab led to something productive. And also, he was starting in like the back line. So more power to you. But it's it's a good lesson, I guess, to not follow anybody on Fall Mountain because if they fall down, you're going to. But you know what? That's another final round performance. Absolutely no complaints there. And we'll be moving on to another. That was a super quick game. Here's how I judge a Fall Guys video in terms of success. Yes, I would love to win every run. I would love to get a win or two every video. However, that's not realistic. Losing on an obstacle course like Slime Climb or, you know, you know the ones, Seesaw. DoorDash is a little different, but like Gate Crash, Hit Parade, Seesaw, Whirly Gig. If you lose on those, that's like a situation where I'm like very disappointed in myself. Um, losing in a team game, it depends. If I feel like we played a part in our team's demise, and we sometimes do, then I feel bad. Otherwise, I'm like, that's the way the cookie crumbles, you know? You could have uh, Elias Pettersson, Quinn Hughes, Brock Besser, Jacob Markstrom on your team, but, you know, if, uh, if someone takes seven minor penalties and puts you in a deficit, then you got, you got other problems, you know? We can only do as much as is possible to do. We're going left here. I should have probably annoyed the, the other people a little bit there. You guys go ahead. That's fine. I'm happy to take the second row. Screw. Big jumps. Big jumps. And big tuna. That jump, I'm not going to say it felt wrong. But I was like, they did a backflip over top. That time we got bounced a little bit. It's going to be close, actually. Gate crash. Probably the easiest of all the games, although people always screw up this jump at the very end. So we're going to be completely fine, actually, if I could just get up. <laughs> but we were only fine by like a second, so... 
I'm happy with that one. Ultimately, I'm, I got a little frightened because we had a couple of missteps, but I'm happy with the way that it turned out. Okay. Coming up next. Another obstacle course for the annals. Of the annals. How about another uh, metal straw sip? Another ASMR clink? Beautiful. Now, we're all familiar with Hit Parade. We all know what's going on with Hit Parade. I'm not going to tell you something you haven't heard already. I still... Hit Parade. There's a great video to be made here. Yeah, just jump on the platforms. And then here, you want to try to fit through the empty space. You know what I think would be cool for Fall Guys? Oh, this is going to be a little tough. One thing that I think would be cool for Fall Guys is if they had like a casual mode and a pro mode. And I'm not saying that I want to play against better players, but I think a mode that had, like, harder courses would be really cool. Lads, we're taking the side on this one. Oh my god. That's my bad. I thought we were clean. This, took, this could still be a clean Dublinsky. We haven't had a first place obstacle course run in a little while. Look at that. Here we are. Look at that bounce, too. It's like the uh, stand-up double. We didn't even slide coming into the bag. That's a baseball analogy. But I, I would love, like... I mean, I'll just give it to you straight, okay? I think in the pro version of this game, if you want to play casual, that's fine. If you want to play ranked, I think that every single course should have slime that kills you in many more places. Like in Hit Parade, maybe not the first three cylinders that you that you run along, but if you uh, if you fall after getting hit by the balls, you definitely die. Obviously, Hoopsie Daisy and Fall Ball don't really work like that, but I think it would be a cool kind of addition to the game to, to add in some complexity. I'm looking for my shiny bullet top, and I see it, and I do not like where I stand. Um, I think... <laughs> Our, our main choice here is to beeline for the conveyor belts and hope for the best. A lot of other people had that same idea, huh? Okay, so it is what it is. We're going to try to get up on the ramps, maybe. They got that golden ring. That's terrible news. Okay, we're, we're doing basically nothing, but don't panic yet. Oh my god, blue is killing us, dude. Blue has 14. Oh my god, what are you doing? You know what? You you guys do that. We're absolutely getting bodied. Come on. I I take responsibility. Oh, okay. The, you gotta hit those, though. I don't take all the responsibility, but I definitely take some of the responsibility. We're, we're toasted. I, I don't really have a leg to stand on here. I got zero hoops. But uh, this is uh, it's a messy game. We did get that one, thankfully. Can we get this one? To oh my god. It's just pandemonium. 12 to 28. Maybe there's a chance. I'm not messing with you. I just wanted to make sure we had a second one there just in case. I love the blue guy holding us. Come on. Oh my lanta, dude. We're so outmatched. I mean, I should probably just pick a spot and go for it, but I'm just... I'm flabbergasted. At the present moment of, like, how beaten we are. Like, how does this happen? Good hit, good hit. I mean, we're toasted. You might as well... What are you doing, dude? Okay, I didn't get it. So that's that's on me. But the one dude on our team is not blamed, because I screwed it up as well, and I had the second best shot. He had a perfect line for it, and was just like, AFK. It's all right. Good, good jump. Good jump, lads. I mean, with this one was just cursed from the get-go. Let's be honest. That one, that that's like mid-tier annoyance because I definitely did nothing, um, but simultaneously I'm also like, I mean, nothing that will tilt you like seeing a guy AFK on your team that could have gotten a, a golden ring just by pressing one button. Meanwhile, he's probably alt tab to talk in Discord about how his team screwed him. There's a little, there's a little irony there. 
And irony, thy name is me. So we we don't have a truly great performance this video yet. It's okay, there's still plenty of time. We do be living in a society. With Joe Care and Pennywise. I gotta learn to do the dance that, that uh, Joker does in that video. Pennywise, I don't think he can do it. He's pumping his arms like... I'm not saying I don't have it in me. I'm just saying maybe it's not the best time for it. Um... But the Joker dance is just like he's moving his hands like he's playing the piano or something. He's, and he's just going, oh my god. Oh my god. I think I could get that done. I think I could have that one under control without even, without breaking a sweat. Alright. I'm at the front lines here. Oh my god, it's a straight shot. This is, a, this is an easy win. We won Hit Parade last time. We're going to win it this time as well. Look, we, we lost a little bit of speed there, but that's okay. And then Pigeon, you don't seem like you're going to help me. You seem like you want to be an antagonist. So we'll start eyeing up the aperture. We go in sides. I think we're... Yeah, go sides. Go sides. Thank you, Duck. Duck of the century. Okay, we're not going to win. But we're going to be in the mix to win. And we're definitely going to qualify. Unless we want to screw some people up, which I would not recommend. But it would be funny, on the other hand. It was a good run. It was a good run of Hit Parade. What, what are you doing? What are you doing? You're trying to stop the cactus from getting by you? Now you're in trouble. Look at, what, look at what you've done. Look at what your actions have wrought. When will you learn that your actions have consequences? What's up with Sammy Sonic fan, by the way? He's got to be like 30 by now, right? No, maybe not. <laughs> maybe 20. I wonder if he's still a big fan of Sonic. Still a big fan of sandwiches? That's how I feel when I meet my relatives I haven't seen in like 12 years. Hey, Ryan! Still a big fan of Pokemon? Well, you know, there have been times. There have been times. Alright, so here's the deal. I'm a bad man now. I'm not afraid to admit it. I take my team's tail. Why do I take my team's tail? I'm, it's better with me than it is with them, historically. Look, I, I, I want the ball. The game's on the line, and there's only one shot left. If Apollo can't have the ball, I want the ball. I want to be the second person with the ball. Please let me up. Thank you. We're cool. No. Wow, that was a great deke. I can't even be mad. Um, I can't believe I didn't make it out of there with a tail. Now, at this stage of the game, I would never take my own team's tail. That's just like... We're just waiting for our moment here. That's unacceptable. I'm not letting you... No, no, no. Here's the thing. You're not getting them. Just give up. Dude, don't just go stand in that thing anymore. It doesn't work like that anymore. Sorry. R wrong guy. Grab the wrong guy. We're all grabbing wrong guys here. I can't believe I didn't get him there. Okay, we're going going up, going around. I do love when people stand in the middle now. Because there were there was a time where it was like an unbeatable strategy. Now it's like an incredibly beatable strategy. That we call that a tactical hit. Yeah, I don't like that. I don't like being there. We're okay. You and I are okay. You knew OT was coming here. You knew OT was coming. Don't be the one that gives it up. We got eight tails, boys. We're almost like Vulpix's evolution. Not a well-played game for me at the start, but hey, if you got a tail at the end, that's all that matters on the score sheet, right? Get out of your green team, Stinky. Uh-oh, Stinky! Alright, we got some momentum. With 31 remaining... Wouldn't mind seeing... I love Fruit Shoot, dude. I know we see it... We've already seen it this episode or last episode. But I love a Fruit Shoot. I think Fruit Shoot is like my vote for most unappreciated game. I know that it's very simple in its construction. 
But I mean, I think it's more complex in actual execution than most of the obstacle courses, just because the degree of difficulty is higher. Okay, pink's not moving. Pineapple's not moving. Yeah, yeah, squeeze him. Squeeze him. Somebody, anybody not moving? Yo, yo, yo. No, no, no. We got cherries and watermelons, boys. Yep, yep, right here. Just kidding. Wow, somebody fell. You love to see it. Okay, we got apple, watermelon. You got apple, apple, banana, banana, orange, orange. I'm scared, dude. Apple. I knew that the apples were in the corners here. Oh my god, who's falling? You just posted cringe, dude. Grape, cherry, banana. Grape, cherry, banana, orange, watermelon. Grape, cherry, banana, orange, watermelon. Grape, cherry, banana, orange, watermelon. And grape, cherry, banana, orange, watermelon. Grape, cherry, banana, orange, and watermelon. Oh yeah, no, it's here, it's here. Just kidding, <laughs> it's here. That's perfect match. Ladies and gentlemen, perfect match. Perfect match has now been completed. That's a fun one. I think three people died. Joker. I like that dim fall guy. What's going on with that? Is that is that a skin you can get? Somebody somebody turned on flux. Now fruit shoot is not an automatic win. Some of my colleagues would have you think that fruit shoot is an automatic win. Oh my god. The universe is collapsing. The people at the front get to deal with the fruits of their choice. The people at the back it's a cataclysm, a fruit collision. It's unpredictable. I ask you, is this fair? That some people have all the momentum and some people do not have enough. Bro. It's okay, we're still we're still going. We're not even in it. We're still like very much rolling. Um, but we are getting Boys! Stop pushing! There's enough space for everybody, unless you panic. See, like, you're, why are you trying to cut people off, and now you fell behind? Why are you trying to cut off the people that are the same people that can cut you off? You gotta screw the people that are so far back, they got no chance to get retribution. Stegosaurus? You're actually a Triceratops. Triceratops? You just made the list. Green Triceratops. I might, if we get a hexagon, I might just grab you. I might just grab you and fall. Then you can post on, oh, my, my Discord, people are so mean on Fall Guys. This, this scumbag just grabbed me for no reason. Oh yeah? Was, okay, well, I hope you're on the other team because I'm about to score and save 900 goals. 529,600 goals. I am on the blue team. All right, Triceratops. I'll see you in the final round. I'm not even calling him by the right dinosaur name anymore. I refuse. Good, good, good. You, you're doing great. You're doing great, Lance. Yeah, good. Good bounce. Bounce it towards the goal. What a great idea. I just wanted to hit it. I thought it would help if I hit it, even if I hit it into our goal. You're wrong. You're incorrect. Go back to ball school. Good hit. That's a great hit. I didn't want to fetter that. There you go. Send it over. Great stuff. We're going to compete. We're going to compete for this one. There you go. We, we, got some, we got enough momentum to keep them busy. And that, what a beautiful, like, textbook hit. I'm actually happy my teammate put it in the corner. They, they weren't going to let that one go in. By putting it in the corner, it actually uh, maybe deeks them a little bit. Gives us some momentum, like, right there. Oh, I, I, I'm surprised it didn't go. I'm very happy. Keep keep up the great work. We're, we're back here. I, don't, I, don't, I just don't want to go too deep. It's not just fishing for goals. Didn't get quite the hit I wanted on that, but we'll take it. 
Beautiful hit. It's all about getting getting airtime and getting momentum and getting speed off of it, you know? Positioning doesn't matter that much. The first ball, it matters a little bit more. But, okay, you hit it. And then I'll... Oh, I tried to hit it over, but my momentum was a little off. I like this offensive-defensive position. Or offensive defenseman position here. Good, uh, that was a good deke. That was a good reversal. And I'm ready. I'm ready. See, this is what we got. We got multiple people on defense. It's a luxury you get in fall ball. When you have a, a teammate that you trust. We, we can do a little rotational defense here. And they're, they're starting to crumble. I mean, with 43 seconds left, they're going to have to... They can't just score. They got to bust it wide open. Like, they're going AFK. There we go. We got a little bit on that one. Send it, lads. Uh, we do have like 1v6 on defense, which is, let me tell you, beautiful. Now, I want to, if I could generate <laughs> some kind of chaos on that. There we go. We just don't want to hit it into our own net. Sometimes the, it, I know it sounds backwards. Sometimes the best move is not to hit the ball. I know, it, how are you going to score if you don't hit it? Well, you're only going to score on our own net if you hit it badly. Sometimes the best move is just to, just to let it dip. That was a great fall ball game. 5-0. Oh, baby. And we get into the finals with the Triceratops. The heck, my metal straw betrayed me. It's got a hole in it. Actually, it's got two holes in it. <laughs> Otherwise, uh, you wouldn't be able to consume liquid through it. <laughs> Actually, Galaxy Brain, a straw has one hole. Universe Brain, a straw has two holes. Multiverse Brain, a straw is just whole. You ever think about that? You're lucky. You're lucky, Stegosaurus. I've decided that the best way to defeat you is just to win, not to deliberately collude to screw you over. I'm sorry, you guys are playing way too cowardly for my standards. Um, so we're gonna do a little bit of this right here. It's not about survival, lads. You don't have to worry about... See, now these guys, they're stuck on tiles up here. That's where you just start to cut them off and, and ruin their life. Okay, I'm ready to go down. I'm ready to go down. This is the scary part. You don't want to land badly like that. But I'm still not sweating this. Genuinely not sweating this at all. I don't like to be the first down. But it does give you an incredible amount of uh, power. Oh, Stegosaurus. My sweet summer child. Let that be a lesson to you. Eggy holds a grudge. Okay, if you're gonna run, that's fine. I just hope you're able to make that. You know, one of seven eliminated. I'm just crunching the numbies, and I'm like, I think that Stegosaurus is gone, dude. I'll tell you, I love being down here in Purple Town. You love to see it, don't you? You just, you just love to see it. A, hexa a hexagon game plan executed. With acumen. All right, we got a lot of space left up here. If we fall, it's probably over. So quite simply, execute your game plan. Don't fall. Just keep it moving. We don't have to use every tile. We just have to use many tiles. I'm still not sweating it at all. Two more people have to fall. I'm starting to sweat it. But they don't have that much space left. Nor do I. Triceratops, I hope you enjoyed your time spectating. 
Everybody else, let that be a lesson to you. Treat people in Fall Guys the way you want to be treated, lest you run into the Joker on the mean streets of Falltopia. And he might just snatch your crown. For now, thanks for watching. Hope you guys have enjoyed the episode. If you did, click the like button. It's the best way to send a message to YouTube that, hey, this algorithm, it could really use a video like this. But we've got to kick those numbers up. If you enjoyed the episode, please do click the like button. I appreciate it a great deal. Thanks for your support and your subscriptions. I'll see you next time. See ya.